name is Martha Eiler, and I am originally from Wheaton, Illinois, which is up near Chicago. Uh, we moved to Greenville about 20 years ago, and I've been pursuing art pretty much since we came. When I first started painting, I was doing still life with bright colors and bright sunlight and dark shadows, and I really enjoyed doing that. And then Martha told me my paintings were showing telling a story about the outward world. And I thought that was a very interesting insight, but I really wanted to paint what was going on inside of me. So I started pursuing a different way of painting. And I met someone who taught me very detailed realism and how to do figures. That's what I've been doing lately. That's not what I hope to do. I hope to combine those two things. But I still want to do paintings that describe emotions that people can identify with. I uh, went to college and I wanted to be an art major and so that's what I pursued for about two years and then I uh, realized that I wasn't in the right place. The school I went to was more interested in abstract and ex uh, conceptual art which I did not understand at the time. So I changed my major. And then later in life, I took another course on portraiture, pencil portraits, and I started doing that and realized, I can do this. So I focused on that for quite a long time. And then I took a painting course and I started painting. And it, I just really enjoy painting. That's my favorite thing. The piece behind me, I saw as I was out riding my bike. This is a very rural area, so when you ride your bike out about five miles, it gets to be incredibly beautiful. And one day we saw this scene, and it just made such an impression on me to see the bright sky behind the rain clouds and the rain, actually you can see the rain coming down. And I just, I wanted to do that. I don't usually do landscapes, but I wanted to try this one. This one just kind of happened. I started um, with the figure, and I originally had storm clouds in the background with lightning, and but it just wasn't working. So then I started thinking about what symbolism I could put in. So I put in the bowl, which is a symbol of invitation, and an egg, which is a symbol of new life. And I thought this is a painting about leaving the past behind and choosing something new. My biggest challenge is finding time to paint. There is always things that people need or people want from you and it's hard for me to say no. I'm not good at saying no. So finding the time is difficult. My goals are to continue painting. I like doing figurative work and I want to start taking my own photographs of models, setting up models the way I want them to be and then painting from that. An art gallery is very important for the whole community, not just for artists. It gives artists a place to hang their work and to show the community what they do, but it also gives the community a chance to see another point of view, a whole other world that exists. If you don't have an art gallery, you don't know what, what art is and you don't know how important it is to you.